Well, hello everybody and welcome to the Q&A. Before I get into this video, if you guys are wondering what video I'm using, I'm using one of my old live streams for the very first time, I think, my first ever live stream that I did on PlayStation, and this is where I'm actually building the start of the school build. So, if you see me stopping game at any time, it's mainly because it is the, it's the live stream from a long time ago. So today we are going to start with our first question, and that is going to be from Mr. Unlimited. He goes, how old are you? I'm 20, I'm going to be 21 in April. Man, I feel old. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and his second question is, what version and server do you play on Minecraft? I play on 1.15, and the server is called pgmc.net. It's a fantastic server, they've got towny, pvp, free build, and skyblock, and creative, if I think. That is what server I play on, and that is what version it is. Your next question is, when are you going to play more games together? Or when are we going to play more games together? Uh, well, obviously you're working dude, and I'm trying to get, like, say, daily content out, but hopefully we can soon, man. I hope you, I hope you're a DM about that. So hopefully that answers your question, buddy. And our next question goes to Swift Nation. He's a good friend of mine. Um, he plays on the 5M server I play with Vintage Roleplay, and he is also my friend on PlayStation. And we built, I think, a world together on Minecraft. But to your question, dude, it says, when are you going to do a video on 5M? Well, if you guys don't know, I've, I've did a recent one about, I think it was roughly a month ago, where I was RPing as a criminal. Um, if you guys haven't seen that video, I'll put the uh, link in the description below. And he goes, and if so, when are you going to do a series of it? Well, I was going to do a, like a, a month, like a monthly video about 5M, or say every other week, but obviously I haven't gotten around to do that. But if I do, man, it would have to be like, it would have to be every other week, I think. So that would be like a series of the server and obviously me up in. So hopefully that is a question, my dude. Uh, our next question goes to Superside, su sorry, Superside Kane. He goes, I've got three for you. Okay, so let's, let's get ready. What brought you to um, MC Monarch in the first place? If you guys don't know what MC Monarch is, it's a server I used to play on a long, long time ago. Well, until 2017, until the server went down. Um, what brought me to it? Well, I first got Minecraft in 2012, so that's when I first obviously started playing on. That's when I first started playing on MC Monarch. I went on to Google and put in you know Minecraft Servers UK, and that one came up. And at the time, there was obviously a lot of people on there, so I was like, "Oh, this looks good." So I went on it and been on there ever since. I think I've been on there for like two or three restarts. I'm pretty sure because when I first ever joined, it had like a spawn where you could go to, and you go into like this part of the room and it has like a sandy area, I think a jungle at the time, I can't remember if jungle was back then, um, ice and sand, I think I just said sand and I, I can't fully remember, but you could go to a room and you could go, oh, where shall I build? You can go to a sand, obviously ice, snow, jungle and obviously grass, um, but, I, but yeah, that's what brought me to it dude, it looked interesting at the time and you know, I've stuck with it ever since, and he goes, the original Devon was so fun, dude, I know. I'm just glad that I got the Towny World save from MC Monarch. Um, if I could rebuild it again in PGMC, I would. Obviously, I built the town spawn with the help of... Um, I can't remember his name now. With the help of a good friend of mine. I can't remember your name, dude, I apologise. <laughs> I'm not very good with names, so I apologise. But if it wasn't for my friend, he obviously that would help me build the town in MC Monarch. Um, I wouldn't actually have the town spawn I have now in PGMC.net, so thank you very much, dude. I just wish I remember your name, because I can't remember his name. I feel so bad right now. This is with my brain, obviously, I can't remember names. But anyways, getting back to the questions. If you could relearn or perfect any skill, what would it be? Oh, God. Um, skill. Oh, Jesus. Um, that is a very good question, dude. I actually don't know. Well, saying that, I would love to learn how to basically edit a lot more and say have like a lot of those animations that people do on their videos and stuff like that. I would love to do that, learn to basically perfect that skill. Uh, and a follow up question is Would you like to learn some Minecraft building techniques sometime? Yes, dude, I would love that because if you guys don't know, I'm, I'm not the greatest builder. Obviously, in PS4, I can build a perfect build as you can see right now. Um, I built my high school that I went to, um, but yeah, dude, that that would be fantastic because I'd love to know how to build like medieval type buildings and modern buildings. Um, so yeah, 
hopefully that answers your question, my dude. But yeah, I would love to know. I would love to know how to build those kind of buildings. So I, I'll hit you DM later, buddy. And our next question goes to Jordan. If you don't know who he is, he is a moderator in PGMC.net. He goes, best gamer EUW is. Right. I don't know what EUW stands for, but I did look it up, and all it said was European Union something. Um, so I'm like, oh, I don't know. But the best gamer, I think, would have to be one of the Hat Films members. If you don't know who they are, they're a part of the podcast, and I've been watching them for a very long time now. And I think the best gamer in the Hat, in Hat Films would have to be... Hmm, I think it would have to be Al Smithy, because he's just brilliant and he's just funny as hell. So I think he would be a perfect gamer. Uh, he also says, when are you, when, also, when is PGMC getting another spicy Devon PvP area? If you guys don't know, I did recently remove the Devon PvP in the town, mainly because no one was going to it and it was too big, so I removed it. I still got all the stuff there, but it's in a, it's like a work in progress at the moment of removing everything. But Jordan, I do plan on building another PvP sometime in the future, say in a couple of months, but it's going to be a very smaller PvP compared to the one I had before. And you have, like I say, a lot of parkour stuff and stuff like that in it. But yeah, hopefully that answers your question, dude. Our second to last question goes to Spark. If you don't know who he is, he is a good friend of mine. And also, he is a staff member in Dinger's Roleplay, which is the 5M server I play on. He asks, when are you going to do a video with me? Hmm, never. No, I'm joking, dude. We can, If you want, we can say RP as an Elio together, or we can do like a bit of Civ RP for... Uh, 5 video man, I think that'd be amazing. Or we could do, like, say, play something on Minecraft and record it that way, I think that'd be amazing. And our last, last one goes to my good friend Scott. He is also a moderator and a good friend of mine in Vintage Roleplay. I, I can't, sad, I sadly can't show you his comment, mainly because he sent me it via DMs. So, he's, he asks, Why and when did you start with YouTube and recording videos? That's a good question. I think I started back in 2011 or 2012 with Roblox. Yes, I played Roblox when I was a kid. Yeah, I was a big fan of it back then. So I'm still I am, but I don't play it as much as I used to put it that way. Don't judge. You know, a lot of people played Roblox. But yeah, anyways. Um, but why did I start YouTube? That's a good question. I think at the time I was watching the Yogg's cast, and they obviously they were making Minecraft videos, and I was like, ooh. I think I could do that, and so yeah, they're the, like the main people that actually inspired me to start doing YouTube, in in a way. And his next question is, what is your future plans about YouTube? Is it just a fun thing or something you want to do for a living, if it goes well? Hmm, not really. No, to the like, if you mean like getting paid part of it. Like, I, I just do, I gotta be honest, I actually do YouTube for fun. You know, I try to entertain you guys and stuff like that. Hopefully, hopefully I do. But I would never ever do YouTube for money. And say, if it did ever come to that point where I was, you know, getting money for, for doing YouTube, i will put most of the money, you know, going to charity and stuff, and most of it going to, say, the living part of side of it. So, like, me getting some food and better games and stuff like that for you guys. But that's what I would do with the money, is, like, give it to charity, because, you know, they just, they need it more than I do. But that's what I would do, and also if I ever do become a big channel, I think what I'll do, I'll help out like, say, smaller channels. So like, say, people that's only got, say, 100 subs and stuff like that, I would help them out. Because it's it's difficult, like, obviously I've been stuck in 1.7k for a very long time, I think for the last two to three years. So I know the struggle, so hopefully I can help a lot of other small channels out if I can. But yeah, hopefully that's, I hopefully answered your guys' questions as the, basically the way you guys wanted them answered. If not, I do apologise. I'm not the very best at, say, answering questions, but hopefully I did my very best. So all I can say is thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy today's video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, everyone.